So in lesson two, we look at um, the revision of hypotheses testing on the binomial distribution. So standard treatment, example one, standard treatment for a particular disease, two-fifths probability of success. A certain doctor has undertaken research in this area and has produced a new drug, which has been successful with 11 out of 20 uh, patients. The doctor claims that the new drug represents an improvement on the standard treatment. 5% significance level test the claim. Okay, uh, so um, X follows a binomial distribution. The p-value that's being tested is two-fifths, so H0 is equal to, is p is equal to 0 0.4, and we are testing against an improvement. So therefore, our alternative hypothesis is P is greater than 0 0.4. In a binomial hypothesis, we now look for our evidence, which in this case was 11. And we work out the probability of our evidence or worse occurring. The direction of that inequality sign will always be the same as the direction of the one in the alternative hypotheses. So the probability of x being greater than or equal to 11, the probability of our observed evidence or worse occurring. We now can pick out the probability from our calculator and that gives us 0 0.1275. And then we compare our probability with the significance level of the test. In this case, a one-tailed test. So we're comparing our probability with 0 0.05. Um, in this case, our probability is uh, reasonably large. It's not significantly small. It's not small enough to cause us to reject the null hypotheses. So we accept H0 and conclude that there's not enough evidence um, that they suggest the new drug is any better than the old one.